Most Expensive Golf Clubs Ever After the hassle of the week's work amidst the frequent business meetings, travels, project launch, etc., weekend is a great way for the elites to restore all lost energy, and when they do that, they do it in style. Come on, you wouldn't expect an elite with billions of dollars in the bank to spend the week like a commoner. Most elites spend the weekend in five-star to ease the weekday stress while many team with business partners and elite friends for a golf game. Hey everyone, welcome to your favorite luxury channel, and in today's video, we will be discussing the most expensive golf clubs ever. Without further ado, let's get into it. Honma Golf's 5-star single club, $5,400. The Japanese craftsmen at Honma have been committed to manufacturing the highest quality golf clubs in the world for over 60 years, with their 5-star club range the pinnacle of their work. Honma's designers work closely with some of the best golfers in the world to ensure the finished clubs infuse every movement of the client's hands, and the 5-star single club is no exception. Made with some of the most expensive precious metals in the world, the 5-star single club is plated in 24 karat gold for a truly luxurious finish. This expensive golf club is crafted from 38 HRC American Aerospace Class 17-4, which means that the metal used has been rigorously tested equivalent to materials used in the aerospace industry. Imported titanium alloy is used for the club's strike surface, with steel imported from Datong, Japan to ensure it meets the highest possible standards. These handcrafted clubs are incredibly popular among golfing enthusiasts, with a waiting list of up to two months for those interested in owning single clubs or a full set. Just one club of the Honma Gold 5-star series will set you back an impressive $5,400, while an entire set will cost $75,000. With over 400 craftsmen involved in producing these premium clubs, using PT-1000 Platinum in addition to gold plating, it's not hard to see why they command such a high price. Adams Golf Tight Lies Spin Control $8,500 Adams Golf Incorporated was an American golf equipment manufacturer based out of Plano, Texas and was acquired by the Adidas-owned company TaylorMade in 2012. Specializing in customized golf clubs, their original Tightlies line of clubs proved to be a huge success thanks to a television infomercial presented by golfing legend Hank Haney. Haney, perhaps best known as Tiger Woods' golfing coach, was closely involved with Adams Golf and the Tightlies line, his name recognition no doubt increasing the brand's awareness. The Tight Lies Spin Control Club is available as a 3 or 5 fairway wood and comes in either a regular or stiff flex depending on the user's preference. The club's shaft is made from a high quality and durable Aldila Synergy shaft while the grip is constructed from Golf Pride Tour Velvet. While Adams Golf includes more budget-friendly clubs in its range, the Tight Lies Spin Control Club is their most expensive with a single club costing $8,500. It's a solidly performing fairway wood with an ergonomic design capable of sliding easily underneath the ball to achieve both a high lift and a long carry. An excellent golf club with the added pedigree of Tiger Woods' coach helping with this design, the Adams Golf Tight Lies Spin Control is a great addition to any golfer's set of clubs. GemSpot OM5 Deluxe Diamond $10,000 some of the most expensive golf clubs you can buy earn their high price tag not from their ability to lower a golfer's handicap, but because of the quality of materials used in their construction. The GemSpot OM5 Deluxe Diamond is one such golf club, offering golfers a blinged up mallet putter sporting elegant gemstones. The GemSpot OM5 Deluxe Diamond commands its high price thanks to the five diamonds encrusted in the club. This luxury putter is designed by the GemSpot Jeweled Putters Company, which also uses a precision CNC milled putter head featuring beveled edges. The bezel set gems themselves are located on a gold aluminum bar, which the company precisely calibrates to ensure optimal performance on the golf course. With a head weight of 375 grams and a curved design that allows for a higher MOI by redistributing the perimeter, it's a mallet putter capable of solid performance on the green. The GemSpot OM5 Deluxe Diamond Mallet Putter is part of the GemSpot OM collection, with the company claiming it offers a combination of stability, balance, and luxury. While it's unlikely the inclusion of diamonds will improve your golf game, this limited edition golf club is an impressive piece for golfers who appreciate ostentatious displays. Titleist Scotty Cameron Tiger Woods Stainless Masters Winner $20,000 the Adams Golf Tight Lies Spin Control Club earned its reputation through the collaboration with coach Hank Haney. The titleist Scotty Cameron is closely associated with Haney's pupil, Tiger Woods. 
This limited edition golf club, which goes for a cool $20,000, was produced in just 21 units and belongs to a full set of 21 clubs. It's constructed from a copper and brass mold, with the performance on the green noted for its outstanding forward roll with minimal hopping. While Tiger Woods has recently struggled with his golf game due to injuries, the titleist Scotty Cameron Tiger Woods Stainless Masters winner is modeled around the one used by Woods for his victory in 1997. The specific golf club used by Woods for this victory was a black finished Scotty Cameron Newport Tellurium Tel 3. Scotty Cameron putters have been used by professional golfers for many years and are among some of the most desired plastics in the golfing community. Cameron joined Titleist in 1994 and began by refining the Newport clubs, resulting in the development of the Newport 2, featuring rounder lines and mechanical back bumpers. Palmer Patent Fork Shaft Wood, $49,000. The Palmer Patent Fork Shaft Wood Golf Club is a rare antique golf club from the iconic sporting goods manufacturer A.G. Spalding & Bros, based in New York and Chicopee. While Spalding is perhaps best known for its basketballs, the company has a long and studied history of making a range of sporting goods, including high-quality golf equipment. Produced in 1907, this wood comes with a unique forked wooden shaft with an integral wooden grip and a fiber slip screwed into the leading edge of the sole. This sole features three screws that lock the edge of the sole, allowing for smooth and responsive turf interaction. The Palmer Patent Fork Shaft Wood Golf Club was one of the first advanced fairway wood golf clubs created and revolutionized the game by allowing for extra yardage on the course. Selling for $49,000, it's the kind of antique golf club the richest golfers in the world would buy for their collection, although it's unlikely they'd use it for their next tournament. It was sold at Sotheby's auction in 2007, with the auction house describing the golf club as being in very good condition with some pitting and wear to the face of the blade. Originally a part of the personal collection of Jeffrey B. Ellis, the Palmer Patent Fork Shaft Wood, while the head of the club is nicknamed the Spalding. Long Nose Scraped Golf Club, $91,000. As with the Palmer Patent Fork Shaft Wood Golf Club, the Long No Scraped Golf Club is another antique that sold for a huge sum at auction, setting a new record at the time of the sale. After going through an intricate authentication process, it was confirmed that the Long No Scraped Golf Club was initially created and used in the 18th century. With the date of manufacturing engraved on the club, it fetched an impressive $91,000 when it was put up for auction at Sotheby's Auction House in 2007. Aesthetically, the long nose scraped golf club is different from what you expect from golf clubs today, constructed from the traditional wood from which the wood golf club derives its name. This makes it one of the most valuable, and sought after, sporting items available, prized by golf enthusiasts and general sports memorabilia collectors around the world. It's also one of the earliest golf clubs to have sold at auction, with the sport having first become popular in the late 19th century after being popularized in Scotland. While the long nose scraped golf club isn't going to hold up on the fairway against the latest golf clubs, it represents a well-preserved and important era of the sport's history. Square Toe Light Iron Golf Club $151,000 The Square Toe Light Iron Golf Club is another example of one of the most expensive golf clubs ever sold to earn its value thanks to its historical importance. Dating from around 1600, the Square Toe Light Iron Golf Club is an antique golf club from the earliest days of the sport and was rediscovered in a garden shed in Edinburgh. It's also one of the oldest verified golf clubs ever found, which is the main reason it's one of the most expensive golf clubs in the world. It was manufactured by a blacksmith, as is clear from its rather crude construction by today's standard, and is built from light iron. The Square Toe Light Iron Golf Club was well preserved and remains in excellent condition further driving its eventual sale at Sotheby's Auction House for $151,000. Andrew Dixon Long Nosed Putter $181,000 At $181,000, the Andrew Dixon Long Nosed Putter is the most expensive golf club in the world, as well as being the oldest verified golf club. While only the richest athlete in the world can afford such an astronomical sum, the Andrew Dixon Long Nosed Putter was available to view at the Glasgow International Exhibition. Featuring the stamp of Andrew Dixon to verify its authenticity, the long-nosed putter dates back to the 1700s when golfing was still in its infancy. This authentication makes the Andrew Dixon long-nosed putter the oldest verified golf club in the world, contributing to its high price. As with some of the other old and rare golf clubs featured on this list, the Andrew Dixon long-nosed putter was also sold at a Sotheby's auction in 2007. 
Featuring a wooden shaft, the putter blade itself is made from metal, with a series of notches running along the bottom of the putter, giving it a unique appearance compared to modern golf clubs. There you have it all guys. Let us know your thoughts about the video in the comment section. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and smash the notification icon to get notified whenever we release a new video. We'll see you in the next one.